morning, family. Good morning. You already know it's about to be one of them, okay? When I pop out with this motherfucker him, it is a clear indication that she got a lot of shit to say today, okay? Um, where do I begin? First, today is the 22nd of April, 2017. It is 7.37 in the a.m. I'm up. I'm up early. I'm sipping on my coffee. <clears throat> Got a little Folgers in my cup. You know what I'm saying? Hold on. So, I have a lot to do today on this Earth Day. Okay? I'm so excited, y'all. I'm excited. I got a good day ahead of me. I slept real good last night. Okay, I slept so motherfucking good last night. I got to debut something this motherfucker. This morning. I got to talk about something. But, yeah, I slept so motherfucking good one more again last night. And, um, uh, don't adjust your screens or nothing. I know y'all like, damn, auntie was cute for the last couple of days. Now she came on this motherfucker looking crazy as hell. You know what? <clears throat> Well, I've been up for the, well, let's see. Last night I slept good, but the previous, well, for the last couple of days, my daughter's prom is today, okay? And so, shit, and I made her dress. So I've been, I've been up working on that and, you know, shit. And then now on this Earth Day shit, I got some shit going on for me too, so... Once I get my motherfucking daughter down here at, at the motherfucking what you, what you call it, then therefore, uh, then therefore it's time for me to spread my wings and fly away. And I'm going to be down here at this motherfucking 420 festival. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. How about the game? <clears throat> He's the headliner. No, Nas is the headliner tonight. You know what I'm saying? But the game is, on, is coming on. They just added 50. You know what I mean? And they got um, uh, some other motherfuckers sprinkled in. I only, I, only, I guess, I don't know. I don't know these niggas nowadays. But they got them niggas sprinkled in. But I ain't coming to come see them no way. I'm coming to come see these other motherfuckers. Okay? So, um, this evening, uh, yeah, I'm going to ask that uh, y'all, if y'all ain't got nothing else to do, and you live in Southern California, hey, hey, either you going to crush groove tonight, okay, and that's going to be all right, too. Now, that's going to be at the farm and shit and quick. And who else going to be at that motherfucker? Uh, ja Rule and Ashanti. I don't really understand that shit because for the most part, you know, like the West Coast ones, there'd be a lot of West Coast rappers and shit. And that's what kind of got me tripping on this right here, this High Times. Because it's High Times Cannabis. It's called High Times Cannabis something. High Times High Times. High Times Cannabis Cup dot com. Them motherfuckers. Bay, bay. It's been going on. It's going to go for three motherfucking days. Okay? This is a, this is, nigga, this is a hippie affair. Okay? I'm finna come fully motherfucking filleted in mine. Oh, hell yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, see, at first, I was going to make me an outfit. I was going to make me an outfit, to, you know, to fuck with. But... You know, I was making my daughters. You already know I'm a procrastinating motherfucker. You know, I'm one of them motherfuckers that don't do shit until the, until the, until the pink note come. You know what I'm saying? When, in, until that motherfucking envelope change, you know what I'm saying? Then therefore, I already know I am not at the end of my road. Yeah. So, uh, I was making my daughter's dress, and then I had, um, you guys were so gracious to help me out on Facebook and give me some ideas as to what to throw together, you know what I'm saying, to put on. And so, I, I, it's like I got a whole new different realm of my closets, you know what I mean, that I got different shit to put on, shit that I wanted to wear that I couldn't fit before, um, things that, you know, just, man, you know, and I've always just been buying so many things. I got to get rid of a lot of this shit, though, because I got, I got so many different sizes in my shit. It's crazy. It's crazy. And another motherfucking thing, do you know I got, like, between... 40 and 60 corsets. That don't make no motherfucking sense, does it? And I tell you what, over 90% of them motherfuckers don't fit. Huh? And the ones that's half-assed was trying to do something, them motherfuckers, I, I'm going to have to take them in so fucking 
much. The boning and shit is, ain't going to be right, so I'm going to have to get rid of all of that. So I'm going to get rid of all of that, and we're going to talk about it come the weeks coming in. And just to get rid of it, you know what I'm saying? Just to bless it out, get rid of it, you know what I'm saying? So we're going to do a little something other with that, all that. But yeah, so I was going through my closet trying to figure out, like, damn, what can I wear? You know what I'm saying? I know I got all kind of shit. Now what? Now come on now, come up with something. So I came up with a few little ideas, you know, so I'm just going to... You know, go with one. I didn't buy nothing. I ain't going to the store. I'm working with what the fuck I got. And after I get through resurrecting and, and, and going through metamorphosis and all that old type of shit and transforming, then I'm going to come on here in my Earth Day outfit of the motherfucking day. I'm going to be somebody else at that point in time. Just let me go with it. Okay? Yeah. Let me have that. Okay? Because I've been having a motherfucking week. Now, this motherfucking... Uh, Mercury retrograde, these motherfuckers go direct on round the third, which means that, you know, motherfuckers are supposed to be a little bit more stable and shit's supposed to be a little bit more better for you. You know what I'm saying? You really ain't supposed to be signing no motherfucking contracts. Or well, see, first of all, me, I'm ruled by Mercury. I'm a Virgo any motherfucking way. Okay? Virgo is in my motherfucking chart three motherfucking times while you're bullshitting. Okay? Pluto and ascending while you're playing. Okay? Yeah. Uh, my moon is, um, Gemini, and my rising is Leo. Holla. Okay? Nigga, my shit got all kind of shit around that motherfucking wheel. Don't fuck with me. Huh? Yeah! All that. So, anyway, it's some new shit that I'm trying to figure out. You know what I'm saying? My my niece, Danielle, you know, she be helping me out on some real shit. I mean, she really... You know what, niece? Look, <clears throat> I know y'all gonna be like, and she gonna talk about this motherfucker on every video. I love her. And her soul is so pure, you know, and your, you would see, because what you got to understand, your vibe calls in your tribe. So if you're giving off a real fucked up disposition, then therefore you're going to be meeting a lot of fucked up individuals. So whatever you're doing, whatever y'all doing, whatever, whatever your get down is, if your get down is, you know what? I'm just I'm just gonna fuck these niggas and get what I can get and to keep it pushing after that. Then guess what? You're going to meet niggas that simply want to fuck and keep it pushing. Pretty much. If you if if you want, you know what? I'm going back to the Lord and you know I decided that I'm gonna get baptized on the third. So then therefore, then I, I'm going that way. I need a deacon or something. Okay. So assimilation and association works hand in hand. So you assimilate where you're trying to go. If that's what you want, a God-fearing, church-going guy that's playing the organ at that motherfucker, then guess what? If he's available, okay, and the motherfucking, the motherfucking chemistry is in there and the universe is working around in your favor, then therefore it's nothing. Especially if he's attracted to you that way. <clears throat> so, one more again. Assimilation and association works hand in hand. Don't fuck with them if you don't want to be them. If you ain't trying to go where they going, because everybody ain't going to the same motherfucking place. Everybody ain't worthy of it, okay? So, karma is a motherfucker. So, whatever you put out, trust and believe. If you putting out bullshit to people, and you, you doing a gang of doulos on motherfuckers, you hooking and crooking and ducking and dodging and, you know, belittling motherfuckers and tripping out, guess what? You're going to forever have to watch your motherfucking back, because what you're creating is what's going to come into your life. So all of that that you're doing, whatever it is, I'm speaking to somebody I don't even know, but this is a direct hit to somebody I know in my soul, okay? This is just a message I'm giving. It ain't got no name attached to it. It got a soul attached to it. Whatever you're doing, understand me clearly. Auntie, talk to you for a minute. <clears throat> you're going to attract that same type of vibe. I mean, that same type of tribe, okay? You're going to create that circumstance and that, that, that you're going to engulf in that, you know what I'm saying, in that form of reality, okay? I'm working on that myself because, see, I done been battered and bruised and talk crazy too and all kind of motherfucking shit. Nigga, I'm going through all kind of cleansing rituals right now because I know I have to release a whole bunch of shit that no longer served me, okay? And so now that I'm going through this cleansing, I can't wait to the motherfucking third, nigga. But on tonight, though, <clears throat> when I step up in this motherfucker tonight, nigga, I'm going to be on some hippie status. Huh? Hippie status. Huh? You hear me? I'm coming up in that motherfucker like, shit, nigga, is that brown sugar in this motherfucker? Nigga, hey. Huh? 
Nigga, I'm coming up in this motherfucker like somebody from the 70s up in this bitch. Modernized, though. You know what I mean? A little abdomen and shit probably out. You know what I mean? I'm pushing them 26s now. Don't fuck with. Okay? I'm 26 and a little bit of change. I'm like 26 and uh, three quarters. <clears throat> However, though, different angles and the way I hold this motherfucker in, baby, 26, huh? 26. Yeah, made it there. So, <clears throat> at any rate, I'm going to put on me a little something other on today, a little sexy something that's cute. And uh, I'm going out to go just simply do me, just going to go have a good motherfucking time. You know what I'm saying? I'm releasing shackles. I'm having fun. I'm dusting shit off. Nigga, I'm moving shit out the way. Shit done moved out the way. Nigga, and I'm like, shit, nigga, I'm coming in. Shining, 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 yeah. All of them winning. All of them winning. Yeah. That nigga, that's my... Did you know that was my theme music? When I walk in this motherfucker tell this evening, nigga, I'm coming in. All of them winning. Okay? The night. Okay? Let me get my daughter... Cosmetics and all that shit that they got to do and some other shit and some other shit some nail shit and some other shit Let me get that shit done and accomplished. Okay, that ass will be down there by four something today Okay, she got to be where she got to be at four Four fifteen. I think is when when they little transportation shit leave After I get that motherfucker on that what you call it Now God I'm heading up here to the motherfucking orange show, baby, huh? I'm going, I'm about to do me to die. God damn it, I ain't got but one motherfucking dependent in a minute, huh? Because this one right here that's getting on this butt is about to be uh, 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 18 in uh, how many days? I don't know how many of them motherfuckers. But check this out, though. Nigga. My baby is about to be 18 motherfucking years old, growing the fuck up, huh? Going off to school, got a little job, you know what I mean? Nigga, look. All of them winning, okay? <laughs> I've been losing my mind. Mm. <coughs> <coughs> Motherfucker got choked up. Guess I wasn't. <coughs> <coughs> Nigga fell short sometime or another, didn't I? Okay. Um, uh, check this out, though. But yesterday, while I was out, <coughs> <coughs> me and my daughter running around and shit. You know, different stores, DDs, Marshalls, TJ Maxx. We was going to all kind of different stores, you know, looking for, you know, different things. And uh, she's getting her accessories and different things together. Family, let me show you show you these motherfucking sandals that I picked up today at motherfucking Payless that's cold. Now, trust me, I used to fuck with Payless tough as a kid. Nigga, I was a pro wing wearing motherfucker and you couldn't tell me I wasn't the fastest runner. Nigga, when the motherfucking bell rung, nigga, and it was time to go outside and play on them motherfucking bunch of collars. Nigga, shit. I got fat later on. I got fat about the, about, mm, about the sixth grade. About the sixth grade, motherfucker started slowing up. Y'all go ahead. I'll be down there in a minute. Don't worry about me. Just save me a place. Yeah, I was that motherfucker. You know what I mean? Getting seconds at the lunch line and shit. Can I have another piece of bread, please? Yeah, I was that motherfucker. So, once... I got to that degree, didn't ever, when they couldn't run, couldn't hang upside down on the monkey bars, none of that little type of shit. But before all that, nigga, motherfucking pay that shoe source, pro wings on my feet, nigga, you couldn't tell me a goddamn thing, nigga. Y'all don't see my motherfucking shoes right here, nigga. Nigga, do you see a wing on that motherfucking nigga? That means I'm flying. I've been flying for a long motherfucking time. Okay? I've been flying for a long motherfucking time, nigga. I was pro a pro wing wearing motherfucking tracks, too. Shit, don't fuck with it. Shit, that was the shit back in the 70s. I'm a 70s baby. See, y'all motherfuckers on some other shit. See, y'all niggas, they don't fuck with y'all so tough. Y'all feel like if the shoe is less than $100, it's some bullshit. Nigga, look, my black ass went to motherfucking Payless yesterday <clears throat> and got these bitches right here, huh? Holla. Do you know I'm fucking with these today? Are these not cute? Oh, my God. These motherfuckers is cute, ain't they? And I know what you're saying. You say, like, God damn, nigga, shit. Is she about to go, what, is, is this some scuba shit, nigga? Is this part of a motherfucking swim costume? As long as they is and shit. Nah, I, I did get 11. Only for the simple fact that I had to have a little room for inspan and, and, and expansion. It, what is it called? Expansion. 
you know what I'm saying? You know how like your feet get uh, uh, spread out, you know, throughout the day. And, and no, expansion. Okay, there it is. I couldn't get the word out. <clears throat> Motherfucker choked up. You know what I'm saying? I was really losing my mind. I guess I was. My fucking coffee choked the bitch. I was like, wait a minute, hold on. Shit, nigga, don't let this happen on camera, please. Yeah. But, <clears throat> anyway. I'm good now. Um, But I got these at motherfucking Payless, though. Are they not cute? Oh, my God. They're made by Brash. And they got these little tassels. They tie all up a motherfucking, motherfucking calf. And shit, man, I'm fucking with these today. Whatever I'm rolling with, this is going to be part of it. Okay, today. And um, what's so cold about it, the motherfuckers was $24.99. Okay? And it was a buy one, get one, and check this shit out, though. <clears throat> How about they throw a motherfucking military discount on top of all that? Okay? Buy one, get one, plus ID, boom, there it go. No problem. Da da da, boop, bop, bop, bop. Okay, your total is this right here. Hmm? So, these. Pay less. <laughs> Talk about me. I don't give a goddamn. Okay? She bought some pay less shoes. Blah. Yeah. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be stepping in these motherfuckers too. And when I come up in that business this evening, they ain't going to be giving a fuck about where these motherfuckers came from. Motherfuckers going to be like, oh, okay, yeah. I see you. Oh, girl, yeah, you did that. Yeah, I'm coming in there like a Virgo tonight. Hell, motherfucking yeah, because that's what Virgos do. You know what I mean? I know that makes some motherfuckers a little salty. You know what I'm saying? But I can't do that. I, I don't know what to do. You know what I'm saying? It's you. It ain't me. It's you. So, but uh, I got to do me. And tonight, these motherfuckers right here called uh, Brash. Yes, indeed. What's the name of these motherfuckers? So I'll tell y'all right now. Rio. Rio. These motherfuckers, yeah. Pay less. I got 11. Okay. And then on top of that, the woman said, did say that they can special order 12s while you're bullshitting. So y'all big foot motherfuckers, that all of us is all in the same gang. I ain't saying nothing wrong. Uh, y'all motherfuckers go down there and go put these motherfuckers right here on, on the list. Had these bitches sent right to the motherfucking store. Buy one, get one. These motherfuckers right here. You get one, your partner get one. However way y'all working out, I don't give a fuck about it. But all I'm saying is right now, though, they, uh, 27. Now, how much is they when they not? Oh, they 29. Okay. They 29.99 when they not, uh, when they not on sale, they 29.99. So, if you getting a pair, your daughter getting a pair, whatever, you getting a pair for your grandson. I don't give a fuck how it go. How it work out. Nigga, uh, pay less. Uh, these ones right here, and these motherfuckers is gonna be on my feet tonight. Okay? That's what you will see. So, um, anyway... Y'all, it's been a crazy motherfucking week, ain't it? Oh, my God. It's been a week of the side bitches, ain't it? These motherfuckers been coming out of the woodworks. These bitches, because first of all, these bitches got, shit, these bitches is union now. These motherfuckers is working together, and they like, shit, we don't give a fuck about the wife or none of that shit, bitch. We coming out. We putting our shit on Instagram. Nigga, uh, Wendy gonna shout us out. Uh, nigga, we don't give a fuck. You hear me? Nigga, this shit is crazy. Now, see, look. I didn't, all weekend long, all week, it was like different shit been coming on, on the TV, on the regular news, just on all kind of shit, motherfuckers going through all kind of relationship turmoil, and I'm like, what the fuck, but see, a lot of people don't understand that we are going through this retrograde, okay, now, I understand a lot of that shit was already going on with T.I. and all them motherfuckers, all that shit was already going on, them motherfuckers, he been sucking and fucking and all that old type of shit, and Bernice is a very beautiful young lady, I follow her also on Instagram for, for a long time. Matter of fact, she watched my motherfucking video. So, shout out to motherfucking Bernice. That's, I didn't even know who she was until I was like, wait a minute. Hold on. Is that the same girl? You know, because I had got, um, I had befriended her on Instagram. And when I, because I sent her a friend request. Okay. When I sent her a friend request on Instagram, then she accepted my friend request. Uh, uh, sent me a message back, and so she said, Auntie, Auntie from YouTube. Yeah, her. Mama, I mean, you're such a beautiful young lady. Listen, you know, that was fucked up, though. That was fucked up. You can't exchange no words with the wife, Mama. You can't exchange no motherfucking words with the wife when you're wrong. So, you know, the, all, and then Wendy's put the shit out there, oh, the, and then put your pictures out, which I'm saying, motherfucker, now you really making some motherfucking coin. 
Okay, besides this motherfucking money that this nigga that you're fucking with is rolling with and making sure you got to, nigga, now you got the capacity to earn an extra little income, you know what I'm saying, on the side, because motherfuckers just want to really see, see you and see what you're working with now. You know, who am I to fucking judge, you know, totally, you know what I'm saying? Because, first of all, everybody got their own shit or whatever the case. But it was like, man, you know, what, the only thing I was really saying was, you don't exchange no words with the wife. You know what I'm saying? And it got kind of reckless and ratty when you got on Instagram and, you know, singing the the uh, uh, Xscape record and all that old type of shit. Nigga, you ain't never supposed to have did that. Because, see, that made you... Because, see, the loudest motherfucking person in the room is the weakest one. You know what I mean? So, if you out there barking and this, 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 nigga, your trunk ain't really that tight. You know what I'm saying? It's like you're trying to get there. But it ain't for me to say this and that and other because, you know, but but still, I got to go ahead on and call it the way the fuck I see it. That shit just was not good. You know what I'm saying? And I understand he is a sexy motherfucker. T.I. is a sexy motherfucker. God damn, no. T.I.? And you already know that that nigga's dick is a humongous. That motherfucker look like he got a Megatron, that motherfucker. So I, I get it. I understand. I got it. Okay? Yeah, he, you know, this and this and this. You never know what was going on in their marriage. It was a breakdown somewhere for him to have to, you know, you know, he had to come and seek you out. So, because then therefore, a lot of times, you can't penetrate those circles. What I'm saying is really get close enough in those circles to do like that. Let me, let me say this differently.